once I die and become a shadow, I instantly just leave the game, jump out, jump back in, and I team. I find this Pathfinder again. We team up. So what he does, he will shoot you once, and then you turn, and you just he just uh, crouch tea back quickly. If you see that, that's being friendly, or jumping okay. up and down really quickly, that's being friendly. Team up and work with them. Don't shoot. Obviously, you have aim assist on them when you move around, so it does fuck you over a little bit because you're not used to hearing that or seeing that. But they are with you. Yeah, that's And I that's found this I one am, player. That's what I. That's like what I'm four doing times. Fortnite sometimes because do you remember when I had that when you had people that are like drop like come to you and kind of do the emotes to kind of be like actually you know don't kill me. Um. And um, the certain challenges go as you've got to kill shadow peeps, kill shadows. So kill. So as soon as someone dies and you hear a shadow, kill them. Uh, if you should kill loot spiders and loot zombies, which come out of supply bins. Okay. Kill legends as a shadow, and you get to win shadow. I mean, as a sh as a legend. Pathfinder's best bet because you know, if you see the ship at the end, you can just fucking zip to the ship and you're on, basically. You don't have to be on the floor, you can just zip at the ship. As long as you're in the ship, you can get on it. Oh, nice. Pathfinder's your best bet, right? You see a lot of Pathfinders in that mode. I'll get a win with you know, I've already got a win with every single legend on the game. Yeah, I already know this. I'm just, but I'm saying, yeah. Pathfinder and Mirage, Mirage and Pathfinder are the two best ones, because Mirage, you can go invisible and fuck off to the ship. Oh. Uh, another one. The Shadow, do you know if they get you, if, if you get hit by one, if you're yeah. not wearing level two armor, it's a one-hit kill. Really? You get if, even if you're at full health and full shield on a level one shield, you're out. What you're is death. the? Is there any special armor and stuff? No. Yeah, it's, it's, it is. You can get you can get purple. You can get legendary armor. So full armor, yellow armor, yellow armor, yellow armor, yeah, health, what I mean everything is like, like that. In the shop, is there like any special? Like, There's a outfit. set you can collect, uh, but they are uh, like ten quid a pack. Well, that's all right. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll finish this game and I'll come have a look. Ten quid a pack, but uh, the heirloom set is lifeline is a lifeline melee weapon this time this time round. Yeah, no, I'm guessing it's like thirty fucking quid. You have to collect all the all the items and that becomes free to claim. Yeah, they did the, they did the same with the last event, but the only problem is if you want to collect all the stuff in the set, you have to buy like the maximum amount of like if because obviously I'm guessing you can you can you can uh, you can you can buy the pack separately. You can't. You can't earn them. You have to buy them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what? What they did was last time. Was you, you either earned them or. Uh, yeah, no, them. I was there. I know. Yeah. Because then that's the thing. But the thing they fucked up on last time was it was Bloodhound, wasn't it? it? Was the weapon last time? Yeah, it was. Yeah. And, and it was but that's the thing. Even, that, right. even if even if you got all the items, you still had to buy or purchase it for another thirty pound. Really? Now. now yeah. The 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 heirloom set for Bloodhound this time round. I didn't realize that. You had to purchase the heirloom set. We have to purchase one. Once you've got everything, it then becomes unlockable, and then you can just purchase it outright. All right? But now, once you've earned everything out of the little pack for tenor, you can then get the heirloom set for free once you own everything in said collection. Okay. There was no direct store like there was last time. Well, there is a store bit, but there's no direct that purchasable bit. We just purchase select items. You yeah. have to do the packs in again. Uh, two, uh, it's set. It's set in obviously Kings Canyon, the old map. Yeah. Uh, um, three. Don't prepare. Don't expect to win on your first go. Oh no, no, no! I never expect to win on my first go. Well, simply because as well, and also as well, if you get one shadow and you kill them, move. Don't sit there, because what happens is they once you're killed, every single shadow. And every single player can see where they have died, where you have killed them, and they will just congregate on you and kill you. Uh -huh. They have a kill marker. So, say if a legend dies, it comes up as a white skull. If a shadow dies, it comes as a red skull, right? Okay. And if you if a red skull is seen, I've noticed all the shadows just congregate on that one fucker and annihilate. Wow. You see. Because that's that. the thing. By the way, they run. They run as twice as fast as Octane can run at his full speed. Fuck off. They run stupidly fast. You can get across, you can travel about 300 meters in about 4 to 5 seconds. It's stupid. So you can't outrun them either. You have to kill them if you see them. This is what I'm saying. You have to outrun them. And imagine, right, get to the end, right, and they can keep respawning. Once you kill them, they can keep coming back. They can just keep respawning as much as they want, right? 
That's until you, until you, until one of them, what, it's, the end game happens, right? When the end happens with the ship, every shadow waits by the ship. And so if there's ten of you left and thirteen shadows, and then we're all running at full speed. You can't stop them all. Okay, okay. I will. Right. I will be checking this shit out. But like I say, if you, you, even even if even if you're on the, the, the squad of ten that lives that lives to the end, if one of them makes it, you, it doesn't class as a win for you because you're not sat on the ship at the end. Yeah. If, and that's the thing as well, the same with the shadows, I'm just repeating this, you get this. The shadows, we had it once before, I had a game once before, I nearly, nearly won. We had a Mirage do his decoy to ring on the circle, on the ship. We just yeah. loaded decoys in the circle. And he was just sat there, we one spotted him. One hit him and half he and half held him because he had a purple shield. And because he half health and got put in the ship straight away, we lost. Because he was just, he got put in straight into the ship. Okay. Even if you're alive, and you don't get on the ship, you lose. Yeah, no, that's fair enough. No, as I say, that's that's exact. That's just like that. Uh, the PUBG game mode that. Well, I said it was game mode that that uh, Tom was playing. Like, because you, you, everyone kind of defended it, and if you if you didn't if you didn't get on it, like there was only I think. But in th in that one, there was a select. Um, there was a select amount of people that could be on it. So like, this. so like it was all solos, but it was like a select amount of people that could actually be on it. Uh, so on the ship. This. And then obviously, if there was no spaces, you basically you basically had to um, because it would it would have a timer on it. And if you were in it, and so like you turned up, you could like you could you could technically kill them while they were on it. If you know what I mean. So like you had to like like kind of basically defend yourself while you were on it. Uh, there's shields in, in this, you can still shield up, you can still med up, you can still phoenix kids up, you can still all do that kind of bollocks. But, like wearing white armour and full health, and you see a shadow and shadow hits you at full speed, you're dead. There's That's no fine. way you're going to escape unless you're in Bloodhound's mode, Bloodhound's ultimate, um, you're double t unless a double time happens on Bangalore. That you know, it procs yeah, a double yeah. time upon hit, and that's anywhere you're gonna live because it, it negates the hit. Uh, Bloodhound's ultimate. Um, what else is there? There is. Uh, de um, that's about it, really. That's only two things that can actually withstand one hit at that, that kind probably, of armor and shield. Probably, probably Octane as well. Like no, run. I was playing as Octane during this event. Yeah. He can't. Right. He can't live. A, he can't live a hit. So it's no if you stim trying to run away. Yeah. Right? Because you've stimmed, you've put yourself at vulnerable, vulnerable, and they can still run faster than you, even you're stimmed. They can run faster than you. So you can't yeah. outrun them. Yeah, what you'd, so what if they you'd have to do, you'd have to use the fucking jump pad he's got. You'd have to time Even it. then. Even then. I tried this. I tried jump pad in front of me. I jumped. I even deliberately slid at the end. And they, once they jump, they jump further than you and fucking back on, back round and back on you and come get you. Fucking savage. I can't wait to try this game mode. It sounds fucking savage. Right. If you're a shadow, you are stupidly quick and powerful, right? And that's the thing, you melee, do you know like a normal melee speed? It's like a bang, retreat, bang, yeah. what have you. In this one, it's, you can just go bang, bang, bang. That's the quick you can melee, you can melee stupidly quick as a shadow. Like, it's like zombie, like, do you ever play, um, what's it called, turned on Black Ops 2, where you play the zombie? Yeah. It's that kind of melee speed. Oh, wow. Wow, that's mad. I'm gonna load FX now. I'm way too good on fucking Fortnite, it's ridiculous. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. Back in a sec.
you play Doom, by the way? The 2016 Doom with Bob no. Bethesda? You didn't? Okay. Fuck. Also, when you log in for the first time, you get some free music. Oh, nice. Nice. I'm being fucking sniped at the minute. Come on, fucking run, 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 run. I can't out snipe this guy, he's actually quite good. Every right. character that you every skin in this pa in these packs has a has two Halloween kill quips uh come free with it. Oh nice. I'm gonna hide behind this car. Come on then you prick. Where are you? I can I can buy a Halloween skin, just noticed. Because the only difference with these, though, Tom, is you could. You know, you can buy these directly, actually. Every skin in these packs you can buy directly. How much are they directly? Uh, there are, th there, are, there are ten at each. Uh, there are t eight quid each item is eight pound. Each individual item, right? So you can guarantee something by purchasing it, but then you could also buy a pack and get two things for the same price. Uh. Uh, there is a peacekeeper skin there. Yeah. Ghouls and ghost. Ghost. Uh, ghouls and ghost. Eh. On that one. You can get a jack o' lantern trinket. A wing menace. You can get a creature of the night uh, crypto emote uh, intro. Um, Hallows I. Hallows Eve. Jack o' lanterns. Chalice web. Fuck me sideways, fuck me sideways. Why are people so annoyingly strong on this game? You can get a Dracula, a vampire version of Crypto as a legendary skin. You can get a legendary Bloodhound skin, which is basically him as a back pumpkin head. I like that, that's cool. There's a Wraith skin which is basically as an evil witch. Of course it skin's basically it. Literally, like, I'm too good at this game now. I just sniped two guys. Oh my god, is there another guy over there? Seriously. Where's he being rocketed from? What's he from over there? Oh wow. I'm sorry, but I'm murking right now. Absolutely fucking murking. This guy just tried jump killing me, and I literally just dropped down the fucking. Well, he jumped down, I literally just jumped round, spam round, and just full on floored him. Like, that was skills. Like, 
Right, so I'm on six kills. Oh, sorry, mate. That's seven kills. Make that seven. Hmm? Mate, my sniping. I just I snipe so many people clean out. Interesting thing in the battle pass this season that I'm interested I'm actually wanting is the longbow skin to start off with. And probably Pathfinder. That's really that's kinda of about it really. Yeah. That's all I'm really particularly wanting from this battle pass. Not an awful lot really. Peacekeeper skin at the end. Eh, it's alright. Yeah, but what I mean is it's like that is part of the you know. It's alright, I still prefer my one. I still pers just person myself, I still prefer buy my skin for it. Keith, just to let you know, I'm currently on a solo game with 8 kills. Nine kills. Keith, I swear to god I'm on nine kills. This is insane. This is actually insane. There's actually only three people left. Keith, and I'm on nine kills. There's actually going to be one guy left there fighting over this hill. I could actually finish this game on 10 kills. It would be the best game I've ever had. Two people left. I just want the game. I just want the game. Ten kills. Ah, oh, yeah. You can't touch me, bitch. Oh, mate. 